What's up, everybody? Welcome back to On The Warpath. It's Sanchez405. If you're new, make sure you click the subscribe button. Hit the bell so you get notifications anytime there's new content posted. And as always, like, comment, share this video out. Greatly appreciate it because we're talking Washington football team news all the time here. And in the NFL draft and with the 19th selection in the 2021 draft, the Washington football team selects Jamin Davis, linebacker, the University of Kentucky. And what do you get with Jamin Davis? Well, you get 6'4", 234 pounds, junior of straight baller, named one of the most athletic linebackers in the draft. Here's are some of his measurables. Uh, he had a 42-inch vertical, 11-foot broad jump. His 40 time, he was clocked at 4'3", 7", and 4 Point one, excuse me, four point four one, and at UK's pro, uh, pro day, he had over a hundred uh, tackles, three interceptions, a forced fumble, block kick in just ten games last season, playing for the Wildcats, and he really only had one complete season under his belt, but he took the uh, leap here. Some folks had him graded as a third round pick, a, a so a day two pick, and. Uh, Pro football folks, I think, had him as fourth or fifth on their list. Has his best game against at Tennessee. And he had 28 run stops. And he was targeted compared to the reception. He allowed 30 out of 40 passes. That's where his game is kind of weak, his coverage. But they, they like his frame. And he's only missed on 11 out of 150 tackle attempts. So he is good a good radius tackler there and this is somebody that you need with Saquon Barkley coming back you also have uh Zeke Elliott who may be healthy again come this season so it's going to be interesting to see uh, he did have that interception that we talked about and uh, his passer rating allowance was a little low but he has that ideal frame this is a good pickup I like it uh of course we thought a lot of us, say, and let's keep it honest, thought maybe Washington may jump up for a quarterback. That was a rumor that they may jump up and even not for a quarterback. Justin Fields started a slot, but Chicago went and traded with the Giants, bumped up to 11. Mac Jones fell to 15, where we thought he would go to New England. And a lot of, I thought it was going to be JOK, but it was not JOK. And he continues at the point of this video, continues to slide down on the draft board and that may be because of his frame uh, I had Morig on our um, graphic for um, the draft preview and that was not to be had either but this guy right here Jamin Davis number 44 double quattro is coming to the Burgundy goal and I'm excited to see what he can do what he can do behind this line of a healthy Ionitis Jonathan Allen is last year. Deron Payne coming back off. Uh, and, and Tim Settle trying to build off a strong seed. And then our book ends with uh, with uh, Sweat and Young. This guy should be able to eat. Pair him up with Cole Holcomb or John Bostic right there. And, and who knows? What do you think? What do you think of the pick? I give this pick a B plus just because you may have been able to get him later. But I think this is the right move for Washington. They drafted for need, and this is the guy they wanted. So I'll give it a B-plus right now. You tell me what you're thinking in the comments. Do you like this pick? Do you wish they had went somewhere else? Do you wish they trade it up or trade it back to get more picks? Uh, just let me know. I'm going to be here all draft with a video whenever we draft a draft pick here. And as always, I am Sanchez Flower 5 I love you guys. Appreciate everything you're doing to help this channel grow and help this brand grow of On The Warpath. Shout out to my pops and my mom for getting new shirts made for us. So if you need one of those, let me know. Uh, but as always, love, peace, and hail. And I'll be talking to you real soon. I'm out.